This is Witchbase News for Friday the 6th of December 2019. I'm Commander Burr. In this weeks news ...the Operation Ida Holiday Hall is coming... ...the AXI launches the definitive knowledge base for everything anti-Xeno... ...there's more news following the Golconda in-game event and we'll have a liberal hosing of community news. Remember to hit like and subscribe and click the little bell icon to get notifications. You can also join us on the Burr Pit Discord server and you can become a supporter of this channel through Patreon or YouTube membership. Links to everything you need are in the description below. To commemorate the start of the second Thargoid War the heroes of Operation Ida are holding their second annual Holiday Hall event starting next weekend on the 14th of December and running through to the 5th of January. The event has a number of different varied events running throughout its duration and it will be kicking off next Saturday with a one and done galaxy wide effort to repair a station in a single day and if it's anything like last year they'll easily smash that target. Running alongside the event is a charity drive to raise $1000 for cancer research in honour of Operation Ida's fallen comrade Commander Rakan who lost his fight with cancer this year. You'll find links below to details about all the activities during the event as well as the charity drive GoFundMe link. If you've ever wanted to get involved in the fight against the Thargoids but weren't sure where to start then allow me to introduce you to the Anti Xeno Initiative who this week published the definitive guide to everything Thargoid. If you're unfamiliar with the AXI and what they do then they are a huge and very active community of commanders who are almost entirely dedicated to pushing back and wiping out the Thargoid threat to humanity. This week they published the Anti Xeno Knowledge Base, a large searchable archive that represents the entirety of the AXI's experience thus far with squashing bugs. Within its pages it holds details on unlocking Guardian weapons, Anti Xeno ship builds, tactics to employ when fighting Thargoids and of course all known information on the vile alien threat themselves. Renio and I were fortunate enough to grab a jump seat with the AXI earlier this year and watching them operate is really a thing to behold. When it comes to killing goids there is no higher authority. You'll find links in the description to the archive itself as well as a link to the AXI's colossal discord server. Whilst the Golconda interstellar initiative is technically over the fallout from it continues to rumble across the galaxy. Between now and the 16th of December if you travel to the Upkaniklis system and dock at either the Forester's Choice Outpost or one of the Federation or Imperial megaships you'll gain access to the Golconda Initiative decal to plant on your ship. Also before the 16th of December any Federation rank will be earned at double the usual rate and there is a significant credit discount in place for all Federation ships. And by significant discount let me be clear we're seeing reports of 46% discount. That's a lot of money off of any ships price but off of a Corvette that's a colossal amount of money. I can officially announce that this weekend I am finally buying a Corvette. I'm then going to park it and call it the BPS mothballed. If you don't yet have your federation rank sorted then don't wait. Now is the time. Get ranked up really quickly and then spend yourself into poverty before the event ends on the 16th of December. Just a quick note there is a bug with all decal applications being back to front on the left hand side of a ship at the moment. FDEV are aware and it's being addressed in a future update. And finally here's a smattering of some community news from this week. Commander Nick Webb released his 12 star dates of Christmas musical epic this week created using nothing but in game sounds, some added sleigh bells and the collective howling of Elite Dangerous content creators Ghost Giraffe, Jack Little, Spatula, Turgeon, Yamix and yours truly. It's truly a magical thing to hear. From this day forward Christmas in Elite doesn't start. Good grief. Until you hear the final 5 landing pads 
of Nick Webb's 12 star dates. Trust me on this, your ears will thank you. Word is that Yamex has been getting calls to join the Royal Opera House in London as a result of this video. The editing required to make the music on this piece and then blend, let's call it blend, all those, let's call them voices, together must have been just monumental. Well done Nick. A brilliant elite themed Christmas image appeared on Reddit this week from Commander DMC Rules worthy of closer inspection. The details are just genius. And musical favourite of this very channel Miguel Johnson released a new album entitled Citizen of the Stars. Whilst the album is obviously influenced by and themed around the crowd funded behemoth that is Star Citizen it is of course of the usual supremely high Miguel quality and it's all space and works just as well while you're flying in Elite. You can listen to and buy the album on Bandcamp. There's also a promo video for it on YouTube which is all linked below. That's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. We'll be back later this week with more videos. Until then 07 CMDRs follow the greens on the way out and do keep clear of the toast rack. We very much look forward to seeing you next time.